first my first part of the answer is that I don't know. That's, that you're asking me the question that I simply don't know. I simply don't know. But I would try to give the answer, but but the beginning of that kind of answer, I don't know. If capitalism is a relationship between private property, labor, and profit, then these relations will always be, as far as I understand. The other thing is maybe artificial intelligence, intellectual would do something. That's but that will not be a capital. It will be something completely different. No? The question is, what? Can capitalism survive in its current form? And the question is, and why capitalism have to survive in its current form? It will change and modernize all the time. It's changing every day. We were speaking about that. What direction? It's another question, but it would be changing all the time. And the most important thing that we already feel that it is changing to the direction which need correction. Nobody knows how to do this correction, but a lot of people see, not only me, uh, see that there's uh, some problems with this. It's, uh, for us, it's very important to read Adam Smith as often as possible in order to understand what means market economy and what means capitalism, and just to try to bring there because it's, uh, it's a very important uh, point. So uh, it, it's going to change and modernize. The pandemic has already shown that there will be changes. Uh, in general, this is a question of name. Today, capitalism is an important part of person's self-realization. And in that sense, it's, a, it's a, the same, which is economy. So what happened in the Soviet Union we were trying to implement uh, socialism and planned economy. In fact, it doesn't work. It didn't work, we see it. Now, China is trying just to, to do something with capitalism. We'll see what has happened. It, it will be very soon. Uh, Xi Jinping is trying now, after he got everything from the Western world, now he's trying just to jump away. We'll see to what extent real capitalism can be matched, put in together with uh, that kind of uh, leadership, with that kind of state, with that kind of uh, semi-totalitarian rule. We'll see what would happen. I think it wouldn't work. I don't know in what way it wouldn't work. But I think it would work. But I don't know. We'll see. So, so the the answer is uh, that uh, uh, it it would change. It would change. Uh, it's not going. And by the way, you said USSR didn't survive. Yes, but Russia is still there. You said feudal China didn't survive. Yes, but China is here. You said that Europe collapsed, okay? But Europe is also just you know, on our eyes. The same would happen with capitalism. Maybe it will be a little bit different name, and maybe not. It would be different, but nothing, nothing disappeared. Even the Roman Empire is just now have its representative in nowadays. It's Italy. So. And Soviet Union have its representatives, it's Russia, and the conflict with Ukraine, like always, like always in Russian history. So what can I say more? It would be changing. That's what I want to say. <laughs>